Again, 297 days between games here at Alabama State. And in a time when we didn't know if we were going to have any games, Latrell Tate scores his first two points. And this is a young man, folks, that averaged 24 and a half points a game last year in junior college. State Player of the Year, honorable mention, All-American. At Mississippi Valley State in Itabina. Here's Christian with four to shoot. He'll leave that three short. Jordan O'Neill pulls down another rebound. For Alabama State, that's seven for him. Here's Tate. Going to wave it off. And Tate got fouled before the shot. Let's see if he's Mr. Automatic now that there are people in the stands. This kid missed maybe five free throws the entire preseason practice. They'll get Cameron Woodall with a foul. It'll be his first personal. Team's ninth with five and a half to play, 5.33 to be exact. Here's Latrell Tate, his first free throw. Knocks it down. Tate has this long, drawn-out free throw routine he goes in. He takes about two or three steps back, waits till he gets the basketball, steps to the line, looks at the basket, spreads his feet, bounces it twice, takes a deep breath, and then holds it and has the ball in his hands for about eight seconds and knocks it down again. And that's the routine for Latrell Tate. He's got four. Expect Tate to heat up as the season goes on again. This is the first game for Alabama State. They were expected to play Thanksgiving week and opted out of non-conference. Here's a steal by D.J. Heath. In school history, joining Eddie Robinson. That is considered the Academic Heisman Award as the Heisman Trophy will be rewarded or awarded this week. That is the Academic Heisman. It will be rewarded next week for the 12 finalists across the country. Here's a jump ball out of the timeout. Latrell Tate and Peyton Taylor get tangled up. Tate gets a jump ball called. It'll go over to Alabama State with 2.27 to play. 66-46 your score. 